What's good, Black Star Podcast? Welcome back to the channel. This is your boy, Jared. Today, I'm going to piss some of you women off. And the reason why I'm saying this is because, A, I enjoy doing that. And, B, you're going to really be mad at what I'm about to tell you. Y'all remember this post? Shout out to Passport Bros Business Class. Woman goes viral and receives criticism for, from... Men and women for cooking for her boyfriend every day. Now, as you can see, this is a couple. A white a white woman with a black man. And she cooks for this brother. And I got this pulled up. And she not an ugly woman at that. Look at this. Look at this. Look at, look, look. Steak yams or steak bites yams broccoli and cheese and macaroni and cheese look look at that look at that that looks delectable look at i would have dag yeah mm-hmm bro bro over here happy oh can't sell that and this is what he did for her And then watch this. Everything I fed him, my boyfriend, this week. This looks like chili. Look! Look at this. What the? She made short ribs, tacos, grilled chicken and rice, avocado, salmon. Oh my god. Bruh. Look look at it. nachos. Bruh. Hey, y'all <laughs> Oh my god. Um Yeah. Let me let me let me come back to me. So I'm mad as shit now. Good damn, that look good. Um so, I have a question. Y'all get mad when somebody does something like that for their boyfriend. And then when he treats that woman with everything. My question is this. Why are you mad? If you saying I don't want to cook for my man, I don't want to clean for my man, I don't want to do anything for my man, he's supposed to do anything for me. Why is it that you get mad when that brother gets with a woman that is willing to do everything she can to make him happy? This brother is happy. I can guarantee you down the road that's gonna be that's gonna be a marriage. But the fact of the matter is, is that. We have women in our community that get angry and you have the simps get mad when that brother gets a woman that's willing to do all that for him. I bet you Dr. Umar says something about that woman cooking for that black man. I can bet you that. Talk about no snow bunny season. I bet you he says some shit about it. I don't feel like going through and looking for it. But the fact of the matter is, is this. That woman is showing that man that she loves and cares about him. And is willing to do anything she can to make that man happy. She literally made yams. Do you know how hard it is to make yams right? You can't you can't just boil some sweet potatoes to their salt. You got to put some love into it. You got to know... You got to know the ratio of of nutmeg to cinnamon, brown sugar to butter. You got to know all of that shit. You, and she got them just right to where they tacky. They sticky, but they not too sticky. They not gummy. They just right. And you could tell the way she cooked. She cooked that with some love. She put her foot in that. She put her back and soul into it. 
She said, I'm going to get him. I'm going to make this food and I'm going to cook it like I'm going to cook it like I got I'm going to cook it and I'm going to put my soul into it. That's what she did. That food ain't look dry. That food look didn't look unseasoned. That food look good. You can't tell me that food ain't look like it was it wasn't seasoned. That woman put her heart and soul into that. And the fact of the matter is that you got people out there mad as all get out. Because that woman cooked a meal from scratch for her boyfriend. And that man splurged like a motherfucker on her. Don't get mad. Understand. That's what you're supposed to do. These are lessons. These are teachings. Do for me and I will do two times, maybe even four times as hard for you. Give me y'all. I'll give you 400%. That's the problem. Y'all want everything... But y'all don't want to get y'all 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 want everything, but y'all don't want to give anything. You don't want to cook for your man from scratch. You wanna you wanna order some bullshit food that's gonna kill that man slowly at the end of the fucking uh, at the end of his life, throughout his life. It's slowly consuming him, slowly killing him. Fast food, greasy food, hot pockets, food that's processed, filled with chemicals. Y'all don't understand how how that man's body is this is breaking down because of all of that food that he's eating that's bad for him. Y'all don't want to hear the truth. Then when somebody shows you the truth, then you get mad because you're not willing to do exactly what you need to do in order to make that man happy. I'm going to say this. Shout out to that couple. Keep treating your man right. Grow old. Well, build a family and grow it old together. Because apparently we still got delusional ass women out here that's in our community that still don't get the fucking message. So shout out to that couple. Anyways, guys. Like, share, subscribe channel. Support the podcast. Subscribe to the comments. See you guys on the flip side. And thank you guys for listening. Bye, guys.